Well, I deleted those songs, like the first two songs I wrote. I deleted them. So, and you were saying, well, you've been building up to write an album like this. Can you... How, 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 how do you know the time is right now? Maybe it's, you know, I know the time is right because it's either this, this album or nothing, I think. I don't think uh, I could have written another, like, metal, like, metal opeth record right now. I was, uh, I was done. I was, I'd saturated that style with Watershed and Ghost Reveries was as good as it gets in that style and it was time to move on. You find a sound that works and that interests you for a string of records, best case, or you do something once. Uh, and, uh, well, I couldn't take that sound any further. But did you know when you well, completed Watershed that this was go going to be the last album and that you had no. to move on? No. When did you find out? When I started writing for Heritage, because I wrote two songs in the style of Watershed that I ended up, and they were good, you know, I, we could easily put out an album like that, I guess. But, uh, yeah, I didn't feel it in my, in my gut or in my heart, you know, that I liked it, but it wasn't what I wanted to hear. What was the first song that you actually wrote? Did you say, well, this is the starting point of the new album? Well, I deleted those songs, like the first two songs I wrote. I deleted them. Deleted the, them from the hard drive, basically. Just did gone, you know. It's a bit... Why? Yeah, it was just something I needed to do. It's more like a, something for, 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 my, uh, for my head. It was good to do that because I knew I had, they were gone. Mm -hmm. I can't work with that stuff. I can't try and make it better because what? it's all gone. What were the album titles? The lost songs, the lost albums. Uh, they, they didn't have any titles. They just had working titles. I can't remember what they were, to be honest. But I, yeah, deleted them, and then I wrote a song called uh, "The Lines in My Hand," which was, that was the first one I did for Heritage. That actually ended up on the album, which was uh, one eighty degrees from the, the, those two songs I deleted. So how did you start writing the song then? Uh, it started with a drum beat. I had a drum beat in my head, which was a cross uh, a drum beat from a band called Captain Beyond and a Swedish band called The Hives, which I, n I was never a fan of. You know, I don't dislike them. I think they're a cool band, but I don't have any records with them. Just kind of reminded me of them when I came up with this, this drum beat. And it was a groovy little thing that I kind of liked. And, I ended up uh, building the rest of the song based on that drum beat. And uh, I had played those songs that I deleted to, 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 my, to our bass player, Martin Mendes. And he's like, mm. if this is the next album, I'm going to be very disappointed. Yeah. He said. And normally I'd be like, do it better yourself then, motherfucker. You know, but uh, I was like relieved. It was what I. You know, it was the kick up the arse that I needed. Uh, also led me to deleting those songs and starting from scratch. And then I called him over to my place again when I'd written lines in my hand. And he was like, he looked scared, you know, wow. But he looked excited and he was excited. And that just uh, released the, 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 the flood of material in, in a way. I just wrote the rest of the album in six, seven months. Um, how would you describe you, you, you yourself, this, this, this sound now on this album? You, because you know, people will, will, will start saying what it sounds like, but I was... Yeah, I don't know what it sounds like. I haven't really, like it sounds a bit cocky, I guess, but I haven't really heard music like that before. But the only, the only band I could compare it to is Opeth, I guess. I don't have a 70s like a, in my collection that, that sounds like that. I don't.